An area nonprofit is helping troubled teens through the use of horses. Equine therapy is just one of many programs at the Teen Challenge Adventure Ranch. In this week's Doing Good Reports, we look at how it's transforming entire families. For these teens, this is much more than just fun. We reach out to, to boys who have drug and alcohol problems, delinquency issues, uh, behavioral problems. It's therapy. Horses reflect emotion. If a, if a boy is angry and he goes out to work with a horse, then the horse becomes stubborn. The equine therapy program at the Teen Challenge Adventure Ranch is helping boys identify emotions and better understand others. These kids have relationship difficulties with, with people who care very much about them and, and with those in authority or teachers or people in the community. And this helps them to be sensitive to what's going on in other people. For Justin, Jacob, and Bryce, it's working wonders. They have different moods on different days, like the same as us, and so it's kind of like realizing how to deal with that. He's talking about his horse, but the lesson applies to any relationship. The horses have their good and bad days, and that's really with my peers around me. Some of them can have a great day at Teen Challenge, and then you never know when they're going to have a bad day, and so you kind of kind of have to prepare for that. It's just good to like build a relationship non-verbally. Um, it's just interesting, and I don't know, I love it. Equine therapy is just one of many programs here. Teen Challenge is first and foremost a Christian ministry, and we started in 1973 right here in Morrow, Arkansas. And we started simply as a boys' home. Now it's developed into this. Housing, education, therapy, and activities for up to 36 teens at a time. It doesn't just affect the one kid, it affects a whole family, and it affects generations of families. Helping the kids cope with trauma and recover from drug and alcohol addictions. We love them and we guide them to help them transform, to get past those traumas, to be able to live a full life. The, la the ranch, like many other groups, has been hurt by the coronavirus outbreak. It had a fundraising banquet scheduled for April. That's now been pushed back to August. The goal is to raise some much-needed funds to upgrade the campus. If you want to help out, follow the link on our website, nwahomepage.com.